The National Assembly or NA's third ordinary session ended on Friday with the adoption of key documents aiming at addressing Laos' financial and economic pressures. Delivering the closing remarks, National Assembly President Dr. Saxapon Pomihan said the session had achieved its goals as planned. The 28-day session of the National Assembly Ninth Legislature debated and adopted a report on the rollout of the Socioeconomic Development Plan for the first six months of 2022 and the plan for the last six months of the year. Party Secretary General and President Hong Lun Si Sulit, senior party and state leaders, and members of the cabinet also attended the closing ceremony. Reports on the implementation of the budget and fiscal plan for the first six months of 2022 and the plan for the last six months of the year were also tabled and endorsed. Lawmakers also accepted the government's report on the assessment of the enforcement of four laws, namely the law on land, law on investment promotion, law on state property, and law on mining. The government's roadmap for state enterprises reforms were also endorsed. The National Assembly members discussed and approved the government's report on the implementation of the Green Safe Travel Program, a scheme that was piloted during the COVID-19 outbreak and before Laos fully reopened to visitors. A report on the full reopening of the country was also passed. After heated debate, Assembly members approved the government's plan to improve the quality of education and sports, especially the improvement of teaching and learning standards. The biannual ordinary session of the National Assembly also saw members endorse a report on the National Assembly performance since its last session and the future work plan. The People's Representatives elected the Deputy Governor of Savannakhet Province, Mr. Vieng Thavison Tepachan, as President of the State Audit Organization, replacing Mr. Malai Thong Komasit. Mr. Malai Thong replaced Dr. Kampang Saisumpeng as Minister of Industry and Commerce. The session also approved the appointment of Minister of Public Security, General Vilay La Kamphong, and Minister of Foreign Affairs, Salim Sai Komasit, as new Deputy Prime Ministers. Lawmakers also approved the appointment of Deputy Minister of Finance Mr. Bunle Sin Sai Volavong as the new Governor of the Bank of the Lao PDR, replacing Mr. Son Sai Sitpasai. Both Mr. Son Sai and Mr. Kampang will now serve as Ministers to the Prime Minister's office. Assembly members passed a draft of laws on fine arts, dam safety, and weapons and explosive management. They also passed amendments to six laws, namely state property, foreign currency management, promotion of micro, small, and medium enterprises, people's court, petition solutions, and water and water resources.